Fixed brush handicap hurdle is next in from Haydock. Uh, this is a three mile handicap hurdle, grade three, I believe. Uh, for the cards come up. This is indeed a grade three. The top one is St. Orange, Darren Thompson, Persian Gulf, Jim Murray, Tower of London, Paul Rhodes, Bennett and Archer, Molly at Surfer, Ruther Glen, David Robertson, Pembroke, Barra, Keller, Graham, Clutterbuck, Cider Gold, Derek Hinton, Finium, Tam King, Half Hour, Hancock, Stu Gray, Forest Rock, Kevin Minhan, Drum Haller, Alex Cherry, Vanguard Dream, and Murphy's Borough, both for OB1, 13 of them, and then off and they go. Unlucky for some, 13, unlucky for somebody, unlucky for 12 others. To make their way towards the first of 10 flights of hurdles, fixed brush hurdles, if anybody knows what that means. They've got some funky looking hurdles at Haydock, they're not quite replicated in SO6. They're sort of like, I don't know what they're like really, if they take the first one, these are just normal hurdles, they're jumping now, but in real life they're like the inside of a Hoover bag or something, like the inside of a cleaner. It's a little bit weird, but anyway, <laughs> Trump Mallard's the leader. Most of you probably won't know what I'm talking about. Some probably will. The rest of you won't care. But anyway, Drumfellas in the lead by about four lengths. Racing down towards the second of the non-fixed brush hurdles. And Drumfella skips over it in the lead from Cider Gold in second. Then Rutherglen and Finium. With Forest Rock and Benny Sinatra for that one. Looking towards the back of the field. Murfreesboro and Vanguard Dream. The two Obi-Wan horses are at the back. And I think it's... Good that Obi Wan has jumpers as he's a, an American chappy, as everybody knows. Does the handicapping on the flat, puts his jumpers in, so it's got a bit of interest into it all as well, which is good to see. See people getting out of their comfort zone and going into things that they don't really know a great deal about, and they get some winners as well, so that's got to be good as well. So, Drum Hallers in the lead, Side of Gold is second, Benny Sinatra's third, Rutherford Glen is fourth. St. Origin Forest Rock and Infinium after that one. With Pembroke Barrakilla. Wide of a trap, the one that's widest of all is Tower of London. The way towards the <laughs> next, they're all over that one, okay. <laughs> the drum fellow in the lead. By about three lengths to Cider Gold in second. And Benny Sinatra is third. Another Glen is after that one, then Pembroke Barrakilla. His next Finium St. Origin Forest Rock. Murphy's were still just about about market. Drum Hallow then. Showing the way home by a good six lengths. He skips over number five, that's half the jumping done. And Drum Hallow it is then in the lead. By about five to Finium in second. Benny Sinatra is third. Then Cider Gold, Pembroke, Barrakilla, Tower of London, Forest Rock with a Glen. Vanguard Room and St. Orange. Yeah, Persian Gulf Murfreesboro. Now, half hour Hancock has slipped to the back of the field. Yeah, Drum Father leader. Come on, past the winning post, then a complete circuit to go. One and a half left. Drum Father in front. Finium second. And Benny Sinatra is in third. As they swing around this turn. Tower of London side of gold. Getting a little bit closer. It's still Drum Haller in front. By about three. To Benny Sinatra and Finium. Then Ruther Glen. Side of gold after that one. Forest Rock and St. Orange. Half our Hancock's getting a little bit closer. They jump over the sixth. And all safely over that one with Drum Haller still the lead for Alex Cherry. The Benny Sinatra for. Molly at silver second and there's one being pulled up at about half hour Hancock has been pulled up so still will be cursing that's the pull up kit has taken Stu as its first victim in this race but Drumfella is the leader as they skip over the seventh there's three more to go now and the first of obi Wands is going now as well Murfreesboro has been pulled up as well so that's two out of the race and Drumhalla continues to lead from Benny Sinatra on the inside second Ruther Glen going well in third then Finium, then Forest Rock then St Orange and Cider Golden after that one is Tower of London right wide on the track the Jim Murray Horse pulls and gook around the inside and uh, Vanguard Dream is just about the back marker as they skip over number eight there's just two more Flights to take now, and Drumhall has been challenged by Rutherglen. Rutherglen's going to head in front. Rutherglen on the outside of 
Drumhalla. Then comes Forest Rock, Benny Sinatra, Finium's after that one. Then Side of Golden Saint Orange, Tower of London, Vanguard Dream, Pembroke, Barrakiller, and finally Persian Gulf. They've only got five furlongs to race now and two more flights to take. And Rutherglen on the outside is the leader by about half a length to Drumhalla in second. Then comes Forest Rock. Over the second last they go. Better drop by Drumhalla. Drumhalla gets back into the lead again. Drumhalla's in front again now from Rutherglen on the outside. Then comes Forest Rock, Benny Sinatra and Finium. St. Orange and Side of Gold trying to run on. These are the only ones who can win this now as they come down towards the final flight. They've got about three furlongs still to go. And Rutherglen kicks for home. Rutherglen goes two lengths clear. It's Rutherglen in the lead now by two lengths to Drumhalla in second. St. Orange is third. Side of Gold trying to run in fourth. Then comes Forest Rock, forget the rest. They come down towards the last, and now Ruther Glen jumps him, but he didn't jump it very well. And now Drumhalla comes back again. It's Ruther Glen, Drumhalla, then Forest Rock, St. Orange, side of goal. And he's now in towards the final furlong now, and it's Ruther Glen still in the lead. Ruther Glen's going well on the flat. Ruther Glen's still two lengths clear from Forest Rock trying to challenge in second, but Ruther Glen looks like he's good enough in the tank. Ruther Glen races towards the final half a furlong, and Ruther Glen jockey to look over his shoulder. Ruther Glen in the lead, but now Forest Rock lunges, and Forest and He's up on the outside. Forest Rock gets up and saves him. Forest Rock is the winner. Drumhalla. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. The jockey on Rother Glen is going to get into all sorts of trouble there because he was looking over his shoulder and he's given that race away. Forest Rock has taken it. Good win for Kevin Meenahan. David Robertson will be pretty miffed about that. Forest Rock takes it. For Kevin Meenahan, Ruther Glen for David Robertson, second, Drum Halla for Alex Cherry, and a good race in third, Side of Gold, Derrick Hinton, fourth, and Benny Sinatra for Mulliet Surfer was fifth.